There you are. Come on, I found something incredible. Hold on, relax, man. I can't keep getting in trouble. I can't get expelled again. It's always about me with you. Me, me, me. I'm thinking bigger picture, and you're worrying about getting into trouble? You know what? You really are something. What bigger picture? I'm, uh, we are gonna take over this school. We are not taking over anything right now. Time and tide wait for no man, my friend. But it seems they do wait for a wannabe tough guy who's nothing but a little girl. You're full of it. So you keep telling me, look, now come on, I promise you, after this, things are never going to be the same again. Oh, I'm so excited! I should have stopped taking those pills ages ago. Yeah, right. Whatever you say, Gary. Jimmy's gonna kick your ass! Right, Jimmy! Come Man, here, this scum! Go. You're gonna hate me forever! Come on, Sandy! This is great! Come on, girly! Fight! I'm gonna give you something to tell your therapist! Oh, so you're gonna start... You're pathetic! I feel tougher already. Oh. Oh, we make great team, Jimmy. <laughs> I have to go call my mom. After you. This is a little different from how I remember it. You better leave the way. Not here, follow me! It's wrecking time! Hmm. That cage wasn't locked before! How about you climb through that hole and press the switch? Come on, dude! Jimmy! Over here! Okay, now we're talking. We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? Hey, Jimmy! See if you can... Here, follow me. Now here's another switch I used to. Whoa! Fly wires! Hold this down to get the power while you climb through and get the switch. Gotta use the right tools for the job. This might be useful. Almost there! Huh, a steam leak. I've heard of those happening. But I've never seen one. Bet the steam would stop. Oh, cool. 
Quick, before it heats up again! Right down there! So, Jimmy boy, here we are! The hole! The place where this school separates the men from the boys! The wheat from the chaff and all that nonsense! Okay, so what's that got to do with standing up to people? Keeping them in line? This is where I stand up to you, my friend! What are you talking about? I know you hate me, Jimmy boy. I know you said all that stuff about me behind my back. What are you talking about? Don't play innocent with me. You want to run this school? I want to run this school. Only one of us is going to make it. And it's going to be me! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and morons, I give you... Russell! Oh, man. Me, Russell! Gary, now I hate you. I know. Russell, go beat that little jerk who said that nasty stuff to me about your mom and those barnyard uh, animals. What? Come here. Russell wants vengeance. happy now, jerk? Ecstatic! I love to watch two morons beat the crap out of each other. Why'd you do it, Gary? I thought we were friends. <laughs> friends? You and me. I've taken dumps that had more brains than you, friend. No. I'm taking over this school, and you're just a liability. See you around, moron! Well done, Jimmy. Yeah, great. What a waste of time. You all right, Russell? Oh. Mm. Oh. Yeah? Look, I never said anything about your mom or farmyard animals. You did it? No, but I want you to stop bullying weak kids. Why? Ah, because there are a bunch of kids around this place who need a beating, and you're picking on the few who don't. So I want you to leave me and him alone. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bad Russell. With Russell pacified, I could be forgiven for thinking my troubles at Bullworth were over. But this place is a rotten onion. Peel off one stinking layer, and there's another even smellier one beneath.
Well, Jimmy, word on the street is you're something of a pugilist. No, sir, I never pugilized in my life. Really? And that you've been saying some entertaining things about me and some barnyard animals? No, I never said that. Well, I listen to things, Hopkins. You try and stay out of trouble. Now go see the cook down in the kitchen. Helping her might teach you some humility. Okay, sir. Hey, new kid. You're that guy that beat up Russell. So? What's it to you? Hey, listen, we like to box, the noble art and all that. Why don't you come down by our gym in old Bullworth Vale? We should definitely hang out. Yeah, I've heard a lot of things about you. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Just keep your nose clean. I can't wait for someone to bring her. You may wait quietly, very quietly. What hasn't mommy called me yet? I wonder if she's mad at yes, me. Yes, I was a student at Bulwark. Um, excuse me, would you help me, please? I will not tolerate this. Ailing frequencies open. You need this. Jim, go stand over by the bike workstation. Wait, I don't get to work on cars? Cars are for seniors. You gotta walk before you can run, boyo. <laughs> Maybe you're just not cut out for this. Start over. <laughs> Show me you can do it right, son. That ain't right. Do it again. You'd better bring your A-game next time, Jim. I won't have slackers in here. School rules are quite clear on this subject. Quite clear. No alcohol on school grounds. Uh, You're drunk. Uh -huh. I can smell it on your breath. Uh? I can see it in your eyes. I'm not drunk. Drunk? In charge of children? What kind of monster drinks in front of children? A parent? A disgraceful one, yes. You've got a problem, haven't you? I'm just under a lot of pressure. Uh, well, I'm a...
kind and supportive colleague, Galloway. And as such, I think it is my duty to get you sat. Uh, do whatever you want, Hattrick. You always do. The head will find out about this. You okay, sir? Ah, uh, Jimmy. No, I'm not okay. I'm half drunk, and I'm about to get fired. Fantastic! Oh, I'm a washed up old drunk, and I'm only 34. English, you see, is a difficult subject to teach. I've tried any number of things to dull the pain. Yoga, meditation, needlepoint, looking at dubious sites on the internet. But nothing dulls the pain like scotch. Come on, sir, put that away. Are you mad? This is manna from the gods! Give me that! Let's get rid of this before you get busted. Oh, that's very kind of you, Jimmy. Miss Phillips is the only teacher to know about my vice. Take it to her. She will know what to do. just lying around. I tell you, he's a drunk. These are very serious allegations, Mr. Hattrick. You'll see. He won't get away with it this time. I hope you are wrong. That child had a bottle! Someone more important to beat. Wait, let me get my bearings. I'm rather confused by this situation. I wish someone would cause some it trouble. Like crazy, dude. I hope the police got my application. Kick 
kicking butt. I got a job to do. Here they are. I think that's all of them. Thanks, Jimmy. You're welcome, Miss. Please take this. was never any doubt. Can everybody make their way to class, please? Welcome to photography class. I'm Miss Phillips. I'll be handing out your cameras and first assignment in a moment. See you soon! How's it going? Amazing! I've been thinking a lot about snails recently. They're slimy. Easy, you're not messing with the frizzy puppies anymore. I will hurt you. There you go! More important things to worry about. I didn't even know you could get a rash there. Being a student at Bullworth meant something. I guess me not having a girlfriend. Hopkins, it's not Halloween. Why are you dressing like a homeless drunk? But it didn't work out. Your girl says you're a bad guess. I warn you, I'm a boxer. No care package from Mother this month. Not really my type of thing. Salutations. Looking good. Dang. Name. What's up? <laughs> Remember that restraint? <laughs> Look at me!
rough edge, but I really think there's something special about you. Like that! That was easy. giving me a hand. 